Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to export the Pen 3D, the 3D models in the Pen 3D of your Window 10 to your Icon 7 3D animations. For every Window 10, I'm very sure all of you have the Pen 3D. So now I'm going to open the Pen 3D. Actually, there are a lot of 3D models inside here. First, if this is my first time I open the Pen 3D, just need to click plus new. Then here, you click the 3D view. Actually, this is just a, a 3D plane for you to draw here. But don't touch any of the brush, brushes here. You can see here you have a 3D library. In the 3D library, you can search whatever you want. For example, I search a tree and try to see is there any trees here. Yes, there's really a lot. If I search the car, Yes, you see so many cars, all of these 3D models, you can get it for free at here. So now I'm going to do a demo. I choose one of the car that I want. First, for example, this one. Oh no. Maybe I can choose some, uh, some other cars that I feel better. Let's say, if I want this, just double click it. After you double click it, then you just need to wait for a while. It is loading, it is downloading from the internet source. Now, you can see this 3D model already here. Next, I'm going to export it out. I should export it this way. So, click the menu. Next, click Save As, Save as, as a 3D model. Here, you can choose FBX. As demo, I will just export it out on my desktop. It should be appear here. So I just need to click Save. Now the FBX file is here. I double click and check with my 3D viewer. Now, and just have a look. It is perfect, you can see. This car is perfect. Wow, so now, just close it. And this is my Acron 7 3D animation. I just need to drag in the FBX file. Let's have a look. This object contains 54 meshes. Would you like to break up the meshes into sub probe? This one I select no. Because I just want the prop. And where is the prop now? Press F. Maybe it is too small. I press I press R to increase the size. And then I want to change the pivot to the center. The scale I, I just need to click reset transform. Then I scroll down, is somewhere here? Scroll down and put the pivot the pivot at the center bottom. The center bottom is better. Next, I drag it up and just need to click reset to zero out. Now it's somewhere here. Now I can save this as a prop. Where to save? I just need to click contents and click here. Click custom and then click prop. I'm going to click plus then it automatically will save this as a prop. Now this is a car 01. Next time I still can repeatedly use this car. Just need to drag out the pop the, the prop. This is an iProp. And you can open the location and just save it to a location that you want. You just need to right click and click find file. Now it is a prop, you can see. It is an iClone prop file. You can send this to your friends as well. It is really easy. And that's all for today about how to search, search from the 3D library, from your Paint 3D, then export to your iClone 7 3D animation. I think I want to try to find more. Maybe I click 3D library again. You can type any of the keywords here, for example, dinosaur. Just have a test, see whether can you find any of the models that you want, and this is really awesome. I like it, the 3D library.
thank you for watching. If you like my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and, and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy and happy animation.